Good morning, good afternoon, good night guys. It is 4.41 in the morning. We're about to go to the Orlando airport to get on a plane to go to LA because next stop is Universal and Disneyland. It's 521 and our flight starts boarding at 620. We have about an hour to get to our gate. Let's keep moving. I'm starting to wake up a little bit. We are at our gate now. We're about what? 20 minutes of boarding. We timed this perfectly. Honestly, yeah. pretty good. We're getting, we're getting better at this. Okay, now that we're settled, make sure you go ahead, like, subscribe, share, ring that bell. You wanna make sure you don't miss any of these videos. We're going to Universal Hollywood Studios. Disneyland California Adventure and of course Avengers Campus. That's what I'm most excited for. It's gonna be such a good time. Here we go on to our flight. We're on. We have been in LA for not even five minutes. We're always making new friends. What's up? Shout yourself out. I'm Phil. Hey, you guys. Phil, where Love are you your vlog oh, so much. Thank you. I'm thank from you. Van Nuys. Okay, that's awesome. Well, thank you for saying hi. Of course. That was super cool that we met someone already, not even being here for 10 minutes. Now we are now taking the, uh, the taxi ride app over to the Uber and the pickup spot. They have a whole area designated just for that. First thing I see when we get our Uber to go to our hotel is advertisements for Avengers Campus. But with all that being said, we have made it here to the Howard Johnson Hotel. We are literally so close to Disney World. It's such a tease. We don't go until tomorrow. But look, there's a little sled mountain place right there. What's that called again? The Matterhorn. Matterhorn is right there. You can see it. The gate uh, to get into Disneyland is right over there. Um, make sure you uh, check out down below if you ever want to come here. We have an affiliate link both on our videos. Um, Legacy. Legacy pass holders 20% off and everybody else 15% off. So if you ever want to help us out, um, that would be wonderful. And also, just like this video. That's the best way to support us. I'm excited. We're going to go check in right now. And here is the room. I'm actually pretty surprised, was not expecting this. There's a lot of space in here. I like how it's still pretty Disney vibes. Like you got that little Eric Robinson portrait right there. You got another Mickey right here. So they really want to make you feel like, you know, you're really close to Disney and you are. It's only about a 12 minute walk. Here's the bathroom. Uh, I don't mind it. It's chill. I mean, I'm honestly just surprised. I wasn't expecting how uh, big this area was going to be which is super nice, so. Disneyland is over to the left, but we're going to Universal Hollywood. It's about an hour drive, so we got some snacks, and we'll see you when we get there. The flip side. This is like the main entrance. Look, they have the globe. That's so interesting. The park is right there, and City Walk is literally right there. That's nuts. Wow, Universal Studios, Florida. This is nuts. This is one thing we don't have at Orlando, this amazing red carpet. I've seen this so many times. It's so cool that we're actually walking on it right now. We're about to take some Instagram pictures. Make sure you follow us on IG. Okay, we got our single day pass. This is really exciting. We're gonna walk in right now. Hey, How are we doing? Thank you so much. Hi. Right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Come on in. We are here. Wow. Woo! Really interesting. Very different from Orlando, but they're still playing the same music and stuff. This is really cool. So obviously, I've never been here before, so I have no idea what to expect. There's not really any rides that I want to necessarily go on other than the Jurassic World ride. So. 
we're gonna just explore a little bit. First thing we're doing today is Waterworld. It's a show here. I heard it's a pretty good show. Uh, Tom Paula's manager was actually telling me about it. Excited to see it. Here is the venue. This is pretty wild. They have a whole stage. They don't really have this in Universal Orlando. Also, in the distance, you can see Hogwarts. That's pretty cool. The scenery is pretty dope. definitely don't have that in Orlando. I like how to use a huge stage with a ton of like water effects and explosives. It was a nice show, I like it. Where do we go now? This place is nuts. Look everyone, it's Hello Kitty. Looking fabulous today, huh? Thank you, thank you. I see that Universal Hollywood is also doing a better job at character meet and greets than Disney World. We've seen two characters already. Look at Scooby-Doo just chilling on the mystery machine. Love that. Did we get it? Look at their donkey. Great, thank Definitely you. a lot more updated than the one How you doing, man? in Orlando. Absolutely. Next to donkey, there is Kung Fu Panda That's Adventure. It's basically uh -huh. like Shrek 4D here yeah, I like the, too when I go the, the theater. So we're gonna go in. Obviously, Pinocchio is not doing a good job at selling tickets Pinocchio. right now. This is the DreamWorks Theater. As you can see, they're promoting all of their movies. Shark Tale! That's one of my favorite movies. I love that movie. I used to watch it with my sister all the time. Rika Lights! Well, that could have gone better. All right, boys, places, places. Let's put on a ship. Hey, where's my macchiata? Hey, everybody, get ready for a donkey and Shrek show. Uh, you mean the Shrek and donkey show? Yeah, buddy. Obviously, Kung Fu fans. Look! The helmet of Master Thundering Rhino! I see your Thundering Rhino and raise you one talking donkey! Wait, look at this! The Sword of Heroes! Oh, aren't we hoity toity fancy fancy? And the coolest thing of all, the Ming Hammer! Well, it's so powerful, it can knock you into the spirit realm! Check, please! I can't compete with that! You just received a message from the Emperor! Ooh. My clever son has been asked to make a special delivery for the Emperor! How do you know that? Simple. I read his mail. Is that the delivery? Oh, that looks important. It's more than important. This is the liquid of ultimate power. I love how Donkey and Well, if the Emperor needs that delivery, then we'll make sure he gets it. Right, guys? Oh, but we may not all survive. Okay, I like that. Copy reporting for duty. <laughs> she said duty. Oh, sorry guys. I think we may need some warriors that are a little, um, bigger. Aww. Wait, I know something fun. Let's have a tea party. Oh. That's the boat. Ooh. How about if you guys come as backup? Here is the theater. It's not 3D. You have no glasses. I kind of like that more, honestly. I'm excited. I really like that pre-show. I like how they got uh, characters from different movies all interacting with each other. That was fun. Wow! 
seats are vibrating and moving right now. Uh, we're bouncing all over the place right now. Whoa. For that being a show, I actually really like that a lot more than Shrek 4D. I like how they used the whole amphitheater. I like how they used characters from other DreamWorks properties. Overall, pretty cool show. Kung Fu Panda was right there. Then there's Hogsmeade's right here. You got the Hogwarts Express and the train conductor. You can actually go up to them and take pictures because there's no line because they don't have a Hagrid. This is so interesting. It's so different, but the same. Hagrid is usually right over here. Wow. How strange is that? It's not here. Normally, this is a room meant for lockers for Hagrid's, but right now, it's just a little gift store. We got a little show going on here. Same stage and everything in the same location. There's the castle for Forbidden Journey. It must be a busy day here at Universal Hollywood because Forbidden Journey is at a 100 minute wait and Flight of Hippogriff is at a 75 minute wait. Granted, we've been on these rides before so we will not be going on them today. Universal will always be popping off, I guess, no matter if we're in Orlando or in Hollywood. So normally, this way would lead to Jurassic Park slash Velocicoaster. Oh no, they have the Simpsons right here as well. Granted, we're not gonna go on that, but we are gonna go on the Universal Studio Tour. Everyone's been telling me to go on it. It is at a 60 minute wait. Okay, this is really cool. You can see the Warner Brother logo all the way down there. Wow, this is really, 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 really cool. Yeah, this is insane. You can see the hills. Oh my gosh, you see such a crazy area. This is very, uh, special and unique to me and Kyle. We've never seen anything like this before. Wow, this is insane. Guys, if you're enjoying this video, make sure you go and thumbs up this video. I love traveling and experiencing new views and sites like this. Also, it's hosted by Jimmy Fallon, which is great because I'd rather get a studio tour hosted by Jimmy Fallon than go on a ride. I don't really like the Jimmy Fallon one. How insane. And way, way, way far back in the distance, you can actually just see like the regular LA area. Nice. That's nuts. This is so cool. So we ended up deciding to get Express Pass just for the day. We're not here often. We usually don't. We usually like to wait, but it's packed. So it is a packed day here. We want Judge to experience Vince everything. Do that, and I'm usually the impatient one. We, yeah, we debated. So make sure you go ahead and uh, like this video. Check out both of our videos. We'll be vlogging today. Did you say the price? No, it was like what, 100? 140. One, 140 uh, on top okay. of the additional ticket. We are now making our way back over to the studio tour. Look at the Simpsons area. It has a lot of stuff the same as in Orlando, but definitely a lot more compact. Fun fact, they do have specific Spanish tours as well. We are going through Express. Okay, here we go. We're about to... How are we doing on 3D glasses? Does everybody have a pair of 3D glasses? Yes. You got a pair? Okay, okay good. We have 28 of these ones when we shoot movies and TV shows. Although, we used to use this for a TV show called The Voice. We don't shoot that in there anymore because oh, wow. The Voice wanted a stage without so much traffic going by. So a little later, we're going to show you where that shoots, okay? Mighty. 
He did. Eventually, it'll come. Place the dog! I'm in the shower! Was it? Right there. That's the third brownstone in the middle. That was his house right there. That was This is supposed to be Buffalo, New York, and I like Great Scott Marty. Back to the Rose future. Show out here Square. called Rutherford Falls. That's a wild. Ted Danson comes they down here as Mr. Mayor. Computer at the end of the film. It's called computer generated imagery. I love the Transformers vehicles here. Guys, I love this Bradley tank too. You know why? Because you can shoot around corners with that gun. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh man! That's dumb. It's nothing to worry about, but it's a little California trouble. We get them all the time. Hello! It's got a little, it's the big one. Everybody, let's find this puppy out. Hang on! Who was screaming? Was that you, sir? And she's making a celebratory swim around the little lake as they caught a shark there. Well, well that's not a 25 footer. And there's a there's a shark and they got the wrong shark. My friend oh, Barry's no. in the water, you guys. Give me a sec. I need to get Barry out of the water. Hey Barry, where are you? Barry, there's a shark coming for you. Barry, you gotta get in the boat. Please get in the boat, Barry. There's a shark coming for you. Barry! Okay, Barry is a little contrary. Barry sounds a little mannish. It must be the adrenaline of the moment. Oh, it's a bloody Mary. <laughs> that was a long way to go to get that one, wasn't it? Payoff wasn't bad, but boy, that was a long way to go. Now, what's with that gasoline hose? That's not going to be good at all. Oh, no. Does anybody have any marshmallows, Hershey bars, or graham crackers? Because I need a sure. I need a big one, right? And he'll take care of that. Are you guys okay along the edge here? You guys? Oh my gosh. Oh. So I will. Bates Motel. Psycho. That's the hotel. That's a really the cool The movie Psycho, you guys, came out in the year 1960. First you know time I they used the toilet it's in a motion picture. I don't know if you know that, but yeah. First time they used a toilet. That is so cool to see this house. Oh, wow. That's even cooler. War of the World. Playing Crash. That's nuts. Wow. Video, please turn off the video lights. We are about to go into the Fast and Furious ride. Nothing can stop family! It's the same ride as in Universal Orlando. And just like that, we are done. That was about a 50 to 60 minute tour. It was fun. I really enjoyed it. Now we're getting off. This place is packed right now. Definitely smaller than Universal Orlando. Wow. No thank you, Simpsons Ride. We are now entering another area of Universal Hollywood. It's funny because we literally never took a map and we're just kind of walking around. We are getting a little hangry. Uh, lines are pretty long for all food venues. <laughs> we did find one place that doesn't have too long of a line and I'm so excited about it. Are you ready to eat and drink so, something? I'm so ready. We're gonna pass out. I am so hungry. That tour was fun, but it was long. Make sure if you guys go on and you eat before. 
Ah. Bonjour. Ah. Oh, thank you. Ah. Love entertainment. Super silly, fun land is a little amusement park area based off of Despicable Me. Pretty cool. You can go in there and play some games. There's a lot of cute carnival games over here. It's pretty, uh, pretty packed. There's some rides. Oh my gosh, the silly swirly is at a 45 minute wait right now. Got a little water park area in there too. Pretty cool. This is like really like at the edge of the hill too. We got more entertainment here. We got a little picture up of one of the minions. To our right, we have Despicable B Minion Mayhem at a 75 minute wait. And then we have the newest ride, The Secret Life of Pets Off the Leash, which is a virtual queue only. And we do have the virtual queue. Now the virtual line still has a regular line once you come in. We are going through the express entrance. You're walking through a house. We got the kitchen right here. And we got some of the pets right here. And it usually works out fine. You hear that? Katie! 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 Katie!
kid ride. Lovely. We got adopted. Okay, the production value of that was really good. I really enjoyed like how the ride was built. I'm not the biggest Life of Pets fan, so I didn't know too much about the story, but still had fun. Now because Universal is actually now because Universal Hollywood is actually built on a hill, there's a lower part that we have to take an escalator down to. Here's another view. It looks great. Wow, this is so steep. Kinda nuts. So we went through all this on the studio tour. It's kinda crazy. Look at this view everyone. It's all of LA. We're actually going down. And now over down to our left, we can France. see Jurassic yeah, World. It's all down there, which is nuts. Yeah, the and then the constructing the new Mario Land over there. It's already out in Tokyo, I believe, but not here yet. They're gonna, it's coming. You can actually see the Green Hills. Now, this is not coming to Universe Orlando anytime soon, so we might have to come back for this. It looks sick. Okay, to our left is Jurassic World, which looks insane. And then to our right is Mummy. Now, I don't know if it's the same ride as it is in Orlando, but we're gonna go on it to test it out. Transformers The Ride 3D is here as well, but that ride is the same as the one in Orlando, so we will not be going on that. I do like the entrance for that place. Revenge of the Mummy, the ride, here we go. Here's the inside queue of Mummy. Definitely is dark. Nope. Wait, it's not booby trapped? No, I was gonna go like this. Whoa! <laughs> Did you get scared? Yes. <laughs> I like this loading area more, honestly. Yeah, it's a loading area. Yeah, loading area, yeah. It's much more brighter. I also like their costumes more. Alright, I'll let you guys know if it's the same ride. Okay, I'm delightfully surprised that it was different than the mummy in Orlando. And I kind of really enjoyed this one. I actually sc got scared like once or twice. They like blow wind under your feet at some point and I was like, what's going on? So that was pretty good. How'd you feel about that? Well, it's, it's better than Orlando's. You think so? Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's shorter, but... Definitely shorter, there's but it's no, cool. There's uh, heat room, so <laughs> automatic better. Fair enough, fair enough. Fair enough. This bar seems pretty popular. Islanu Bar has tiki drinks here. Transform and roll out! This. It's Optimus Prime, but these Transformers here are like so much better. I feel like they like move a lot more. I am Optimus Prime, and I'm honored to be Yo. each and every one of you. But I need to know that your hearts are strong with courage. <laughs> so when I say Autobots. <laughs> All of you say, roll out. Yes, sir. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah. Autobots. Roll out. Louder. Autobots. <laughs> roll out. Louder. Autobots. Roll out. I don't know what it is, but the Transformers here seem so much more like reactive and like honestly like personable right like i don't know the, the ones in orlando seem to be a little less young power freedom fighter oh look at this the quintessential selfie yes transformers the ride 3d is the exact same as it is in orlando so we're going to be skipping that however i wanted to showcase super nintendo world at universal studios hollywood is coming soon this is going to be the main entrance i think you're actually going to go through like a warp tube one day I'll have to come to this. Don't know when though. They also have a raptor encounter Again, here at you guys Hollywood. This one's so cool. You can day. meet Blue. Look how huge he is. I like how he's kind of just out in the open compared to ours where he's kind of behind grass. Wow. Oh my god. We hope you enjoyed your time with our Velociraptor today. We are now going on Jurassic World. The ride is at a 100 minute wait, but we have Express Pass. You and this impressive specimen will be face to face. She is certainly a sight to behold. Please enjoy the ride. 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 Please enjoy the ride.
at the Imbrium Observatory. That's what we're doing today. There is the regular queue, and we're right at the front. That only took about five to ten minutes for uh, Express. This looks exactly like River Adventure, just updated, and I love it. It looks great. Other than Avengers Campus, I'm actually really excited for this. We've seen so many videos, so I'm glad that we can finally experience it for ourselves. Jurassic World. Our Uber has arrived, looking fresh! You are now entering Jurassic World. Here we go. That's Super Mario World up there. Wow, I'm so excited! Woo! Whoa! When dinosaurs ruled the Earth. Explosion at the top of the food chain sat the Mosasaurus. The Mosasaurus.
didn't get that wet. That's so much better. I didn't get that wet. What a day here in Universal Studios Hollywood. Oh my gosh. Okay, everyone, it's been an insane day here at Universal Studios Hollywood. I am dead. Kyle is dead. We've been up since 5 a.m. this morning, Eastern Standard Time. Uh, we went from Florida to LA, traveled. We're here, experienced a ton of new things. Super cool. Very blessed that we were able to do this. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you go ahead, like, subscribe, share, ring that bell. Tomorrow is Disneyland, Disneyland California Adventure, Avengers Campus. I am pumped. Remember, guys, every day is a blessed day to be alive, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you guys so much. Peace.